Hey everyone, and welcome back to Crash Lander on Scrap Mechanic. Hopefully, the fans on my computer aren't too loud. I'm literally working on a muffler for my laptop to make it less noisy. By the way, um, last episode, while I was building the cab for the cozy, this part fell, and then I kind of jumped on it and launched it and lost it. Turns out it was under the front of the truck. So yeah, it was that. Um, I don't want to delete it, didn't realize I could just delete it. I don't know if that would be a good idea or not. I would get the stuff back or whatever, so if you're familiar you know, with that, let me know. Either way, it is time to continue on with the cozy. However, I also need to build the water wheel a vacuum pump and some tubing for that, and so on. I won't know how much tubing I need for the water wheel until I have it in place. I also just built some um, pipes for the intake, just some ducting for the intake of the cozy. Um, I will shove these in here for the moment. Get these out. I need 40... Of those, what else do I need? A hundred would block one and two Um, doo -doo -doo. I will have to make some more wood block one. Should be enough. And then two of these. I should have enough to at least get the cozy drivable today. And then I can work on a trailer at some point. For the cutter and resources and whatnot. Just trying to organize them a little bit better. Get rid of these for now. Can't quite make that yet. One more. I'm also really, really tired today, so just kind of bear with me. Oh, that'll take another 38 seconds. Um, I'll probably use just basic scrap wood to set it up, make it easier. Not easier, but simpler. Less resources. Um, yeah, I'll, once that's done, I will run over and set it up, and, um, come back, and then I'll know how many, uh, how many vacuum pipes I'll need and elbows and stuff. Cozy, it basically just goes like this. I need some more ducting, but the intake goes roughly there. I can move it if need be. Right. Start the water wheels. So let's jump in the truck. Try not to kill this walk. Oh, it's dead. I was hoping I could get around it. What do you get for standing beside a truck and not moving? But let's run down to the water and build water wheel really quick. Cool. I'm gonna build it a little bit offshore. I should have just ran down instead of bringing the truck because bringing the truck back up that hill is going to be a major pain in the butt. However, I can just run back up there. I also need to finally build a bed so that if these cute little buggers end up killing me, I can respawn here and not way over at the ship. But I'll likely build the bed once I can put it in the cozy. So I need wood block one. Like I said, I'm gonna build it just off the edge. Oh, hungry. I find it kind of funny how you can drink underwater. Like, that wouldn't really work. Rain. 
so cool having rain in this. Either way, I'm going to build it right here, nice and close to the shore. Easy to grab. Come on. There we go. And then it should be just far enough away that the wolves won't get to it. Just that way, I think. Bearing on there. And then... Water wheel. Oops, that's not centered. There we go. Cool. That's awesome. And then I should only need the vacuum part for the vacuum pump. That's actually pretty cool, I like that. So, I'm going to run back and build a vacuum. And if I can build some stuff for the cozy while I'm at it, I will do so. And hopefully this thing gets up the hill fairly easily. Once I build a proper base, I will probably move the water wheel because I want to build the base next to water, but closer to the HQ. But we'll see. Once I have... I'm not sure if I want to build a stationary base or the mobile base. I am building the 8x8 version of the Cozy. So I could definitely build the mobile base trailer for it. Oops. Go again. And um, have everything I need wherever I go. So we'll see. Um, vacuum, 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 vacuum. Vacuum. Right there, vacuum. Circuits, beeswax, plastic, and metal block too. Chuck it. Not where I'm used to being. Okay, so we've got some metal block too. And I should have everything I need. I'm gonna just stick that there for now. This should be everything I need. I'm, I hope so. Is. And then I need a switch. There we go. Okay. So, the cozy. I need to pull up the paint really quick because I believe the engine goes towards the right side, but I'm not entirely sure. Looks like it. Yes. Or, no. The engine goes towards the left side. So I will grab the engine. Put this on the lift. And the lift is kind of in the way. So I will extend the chassis. I need to anyways. Cozy is fairly big. Not the biggest thing I've built by far, but it's pretty big. Alright, so I'm going to bring this down like so, over so that the engine can hang under the chassis a little bit, like that. I believe that's how it goes. And then the exhaust comes up and over, and the intake comes down and over. So I need one more straight piece, and one more elbow. or bend or corner or whatever. So there's that. And then the exhaust, I want these pipes. So that's, what, four of those. And then a few straight pieces. I'll just go like that, see how that goes. These are done, so I can run back down there and finish that. Um, where's the... There it is. Oh, I've still got three more of those. I thought I was out. Alright, so there's the... Intake. Not like literally the intake and whatnot, of course, but... It gets the point across.
Ooh, maybe the engine does come up by one. I was just kind of reviewing the pictures. Of it. If I bring it up by one, that will be a little bit better. Just for spacing for other stuff. Okay. I can get this out of my inventory. I should also make the armor. Maybe I'll do that really quick too, because I've had the wood for the armor for a few videos now. So once I throw the exhaust on... Ozzy. Come on. And it goes up like this because of the wheels. I just, of course, don't have the wheels on yet. Once I put the wheels on, I'll have to cut out the floor and whatnot. Um, so there's that. I'm also going to make some armor. Wood block, wolf hide, cotton, and glue. So, I will put this in there on that. The wood block I need should be that. I forgot to grab the glue. And then, cotton is over here. And then I've got a bunch of. Oh, my inventory's full. Of course it is. And there's a bunch of the hide there to get some more stuff out of my inventory. As I have too much stuff. Might as well feed that too. Oh. There you go. Right there. Okay. That one. There's that. And ooh, the pants and the shoes. Awesome. I can equip those once they are done. Can I make the helmet yet? Hat or whatever. No, I don't think I can. That's fine. Where do you think you're going? Chuck over here, it's just my opinion. And put the glue and stuff away. I'll drink this last bottle of milk. Once I build the trailer, I'll have a lot more storage space as well. That'll be done when I come back up. So I will run down, put the vacuum pump on the water wheel so that it can actually start producing power. And yeah from there. I guess it would have been faster to take the truck, but whatever. It takes longer to get up the hill. At some point I could probably have one of these just sending power to a base, like through some pipes, and have uh, oil going through pipes to the base and so on. So that should start creating water now. At least I hope. Do I have to put the water in it? Overheated requires water time to stunt. How exactly does this work? I feel that should work, unless I need to turn it and put the water in where I have the wheel. Does the water go in there? I am so confused at the moment. I'm going to try turning this. They don't make this, um, like, obvious enough. No, it's got stuff in it, 
but now I can't place it down. Oh, because I'm holding the bottom. Okay, let's try... turning it. Not like that. Okay. Yeah, let's see how that works. I can't put it on there. I'm going to make a little platform to stand on really quick. Hopefully, the microphone doesn't pick up the dog barking. Okay, so now that I am... It doesn't seem to want to line up. So I'm assuming it has to go... The way I had it. Anyone else that's played this, if you could let me know how this exactly works. I'm just gonna stick that there so I can have a little platform to stand on. Can I do it this way? Do I have to put a pipe through it? I don't know. I'm just going to leave it for now. Set up like this. And we'll see what happens. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. I can come back to it. But, we'll see. If it works, awesome. If it doesn't, I'll figure it out. Okay, back to the cozy. I need to, like I mentioned, cut out the floor. Okay, so. I need wedges. What's that doing? Oh, clothing stuff. Probably because I went away from it. Okay. I need wedges. So... And then... It goes... Oops. Not like that. Cut here. Wedge. Cut here and put a wedge. Cut out three, and then there's two wedge, a ramp, which I didn't make any more of. I only made the four, so I shall make some more. Oh my goodness, dog, stop barking. You're so annoying. Put that in the wrong box. Thankfully, I'll be done recording in a minute. Ten minutes or so, so I can go see what the dog's losing its mind about. Little thing's afraid of literally everything, so it barks at everything. Um, okay, so that is also... All the way into... Middle. So, measure this a bit better. The Cozy is also built with bigger wheels in mind than the big wheel. But, I'm not overly worried about it. Okay, and then a slope 
like this will bring us down to front. I feel like I did this wrong. No, because the light goes there and this goes down and one back. The fenders also need to stick out a bit, which is why I'm getting a little bit confused. Because now, this will go how I want it. Like so. Yeah, okay. And then the bumper is in line with the front of the chassis, so... I will cut out this part as well. So. And probably don't have enough wedges at the moment, so I, know. So I will make a bunch more. Two, one, two, one. I'm trying to make even amounts of them. Sticks out a little bit. Grab my metal block one. Get in there. And then I will put on some pipes for the handles. Because it has little like candle things that go up. I I'm pretty sure it's a two block that goes right here. It's been a very long time since I've actually built the cozy. So, hopefully this is right. Should be. Okay. Now, for the front bumper, we have... Wedges going into the middle like so, with a block in between, and then a block on the bottom going to the width of body, and then um, something's a little off again. This part is also one of the parts that's glitch welded, so that they can go a little closer, but I'll just do what I can. I can't tell if it goes like that. Or the other way. It goes like this. Ooh, come on. Here we go. And then there's a wedge. This, normally there would be a block in between these two wedges, but as I said, this needs to be glitch welded, and I can't. At the moment. So this is how it's going to be. Doesn't look the greatest having to do it this way, but oh well. Oops, I need one more wedge. So yeah, that's basically it for the body of the cozy, other than I still want to build a sleeper. Um, I do need to also grab the pipes like I mentioned, because I need to put on the upfit attachment, one of them. Where does this go? Here we go. Yeah, that's close enough. And then get rid of that. 
there we go. And then a mesh block goes in here. Awesome. I could also... I'm going to change up the design a tiny bit, I think. Make a couple more wedges. And then make some net block. So, the way that you attach an upfit to it is on this bar with a bearing holding it so that it can be easily removed and put back on. However, I'll probably not do it this way, just for lag's sake, but we'll see when I get to it. And then one wheel goes here, the other wheel goes back here, and then all the logic and stuff goes in here. I also built this in mind of having a generator in it, so the generator also goes in here. And thankfully, this mod has a generator. Um, I will equip these if I can remember how. It's not letting me drag it over. Do I click and then click? Yes, okay. It looks like we click and then click. Yeah. That's cool. I like the idea of having armor. How do we look now? <laughs> That's funny. Makes my guy look fat. That's funny. It's cool though, I like it. Good idea. Alrighty, I got a couple more minutes, so what else can I work on really quick? I can put the grill in and finish the little bit of wedge stuff that I wanted to. I just wanted to, uh, kind of, oh, I used the wrong one. Okay, um, which one do I need there? Really? No, I just put it the wrong way. There we go. Um, maybe I did use the wrong one. No, I just have to... There we go. Uh, but the grill isn't as big as I would like it to be. So I will cut that out and go like that. And now it's proper. Okay, that's good enough for me. It's for now. It's supposed to all be rounded and whatnot, so it looks weird to me, but that's how it's basically supposed to look. So, and then the bumper is supposed to be different, but whatever. That is, other than wedges, it for the cozy. At least body-wise. Um, I will put on one of the handles, just for an example. It literally just comes down the side. I need a couple longer... longer pipes. Nope, oh, that's too many, whatever. And then... 
the gas tank goes back here behind the rear set of front wheels. A spare wheel goes on this side. And then two rear wheels. And whatever upfits I end up putting. This side has all the wedges on it, so I need to finish this side. There we go. Now everything on properly. We'll fill the floor back in. I'm at it. Another thing is with the normal cozy, it has a passenger seat, a driver's seat, and then another passenger seat glitch welded into the floor. But I can't really do that with this, so oh well. I feel like there's something still off about this one. I can't tell what. Just, it feels weird for some reason. I don't know. Door is full again, of course it is. Oh my goodness. I have way too much stuff. Get rid of all this cotton. I get rid of it, but get it out of my inventory. These don't stack, do they? Oh, they do. Okay. So yeah, the railing things just kind of go like that. On the normal, like a different version of the cozy, the plain six by six, I believe the front wheels are in a little bit more. So they kind of have pipe on the bottom, rather than the 8x8, eight eight, which has the extended fenders and stuff. I might as well do it on this side, and then I will end the video. Yeah. Next episode, I will... I wanted to do more today, but whatever. Next episode, I will put on the wheels, get the interior started, and hopefully finished. Hopefully next episode, this will be completely done. There's not a whole lot to do left. I will make the lights and stuff off camera. That way I can just put everything together and be done and get to using it. So, yeah. Other than that, as always, if you have any tips or tricks or questions or whatever, feel free to leave it in the comments. And as you uh, words, and as always, I hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching.